Hey guys, I'm Maria Sebastian and welcome back to episode 10 of 30 Thursdays of Art Series. Happy New Year everyone! Here's to hoping that 2021 will be kinder to all of us. <laughs> In today's video, I'm going to be painting a whimsical piece of a girl sitting on uh, the moon uh, wearing a pretty pink gown. This is so out of my comfort zone because as many of you may know, I almost always do only portraits. But a few days ago, I just really wanted to paint this particular image. I turned on a Dressed in Files audiobook and lost myself in the process of creating without expectations for the next two hours. It was wonderful. I have always loved creating art. But I don't think I've ever really taken it very seriously. I used to paint once in a few months and thought I was doing great. <laughs> nope, I wasn't. <laughs> but lately, I've been painting a whole lot more and really loving it. So I decided to set some art goals for myself in 2021. Some of you may know that I am working on a fantasy novel right now. This is taking up a lot of my time and creative energy. Plus, my classes for my master's degree started this week. Finally! Haha! <laughs> so that means I am making art goals at a time when I have very little time. <laughs> but I am determined to make this work and hopefully I will make a video next year evaluating how successful I was in following through. Yeah, so anyway, the biggest art goal I have for 2021 is to create at least one new painting in any medium every week. If in case I have to miss a week, I am going to hold myself accountable to create at least four paintings every month. My second goal is to experiment. As I mentioned earlier, I've been painting portraits for a very long time and I've never wanted to branch out. But lately, I've been watching some Studio Ghibli and I've fallen in love with the idea of painting pretty landscapes. Now, I'll have to work on a lot of fundamentals, but this year, I want to create a series of cute little landscape paintings, most probably digitally. My third goal is to post regularly on my Instagram and this YouTube channel, even when I don't feel like it. It is very easy to compare each other on social media. It is extremely easy to look at famous artists and feel bad um, about not being good as them and see hundreds of thousands of views and subscribers for other artists while we get like, I don't know, like 10 views and zero subscribers. I keep getting questions about why I don't have like more views and some such nonsense that I have no control over. Um, I mean, of course it would be great if more people watched my videos, but I'm taking this opportunity to remind myself and to let everyone know that this is not a numbers game for me. I am not planning on earning anything from this channel. This is just for fun. I don't care if only like three people watch my videos regularly. I post here every Thursday because I love creating art and sharing the process with people who care about it too. Besides, I tend to forget how I painted something almost as soon as I'm done with a piece and having videos online is great for me to come back and track my own progress. So a goal for 2021 is to try and upload videos every Thursday and post regularly on my art Instagram, Maria Sebastian Art, just because it is fun and not for external validation. Easier said than done, but hey, you gotta start somewhere, right? <laughs> My last goal is to develop my own art style. Now, this is an ongoing process and I am aware that I do have a couple different styles, but I'm not entirely happy with them. Uh, right now, I am at a place where I'm not particularly happy with the numerous styles I seem to have. I want to take this year to let go and see uh, how and if an art style will evolve perhaps from the sheer quantity of paintings that I'll ho hopefully do this year. 
anyway these are my goals let me know in the comments if you have any goals for 2021 even if they aren't art related this painting took me around two hours uh, this is done digitally in krita which is a free digital art software that i completely recommend let me know if you would like to see some beginner tutorials in krita uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends. You can let me know uh, that you liked the video by giving it a thumbs up. It really helps me out. I'll let you enjoy the rest of the painting in peace. See you next Thursday. Take care. Bye.